did it happen? Why did it happen? All questions that are being asked tonight. One day after a train crashes into a school bus, killing a student and injuring his cousin. Our Yona Gavino has been in Athens today as the community is reeling from the news. Yona. There is heartbreak and sorrow in the small town of Athens after the death of 13 year old Christopher Bonilla. Police say a school bus and Union Pacific train crashed at a crossing, killing the student and injuring his nine year old cousin. Neighbor Titus Jackson knew the crash was bad before he saw it. All I heard was a boom. Like it was like a bit, a real loud boom. And, uh, and I just ran outside to see what, see what it was. Police say the bus driver is 78 year old John Stevens. They're looking into what happened moments before the crash. Train officials tell me the horn sounded for 30 seconds before impact. According to the police chief, the crash happened a quarter mile up the track at a crossing guard that only has a cross buck. The train pushed the bus down the tracks to a second location at Merchantson Street. The bus hit a crossing arm and damaged it. Javier Campos is hurting for the family. It's terrible. I feel bad, you know, just so for my friend from the family. Today, a school spokesperson says the focus is on recovering and healing. The district tells me it'll have counselors on hand for students and staff on Monday, and the mayor says support and prayers have been pouring in. We're so sorry, and we are here for that family. It's been a real low. Uh, this has been a real shock for our community and our citizens. But it's also been uplifting to see how the citizens have come together to uh, uh, reach out with prayers and, and their thoughts for the families affected. Yona Gavino, CBS 11 News.